Hey everyone. Okay, so this is a quick, uh, quick video to follow up from uh, a couple of the noodles that I've, I've done or going to be doing, depending on when you see this. Um, but uh, A and guitars, uh, A and guitar lessons. I'm also doing uh, repairs and just general setups and a bit of maintenance on guitars for people because it kind of always comes up in conversations. Um, which, which we have with students and with and with just people who contact me really just asking me to do a bit of work on their guitars because they need a bit of TLC. So just a quick example for you right here in front of me here is a Gibson SG Junior. Um, it's from a good friend uh, Axel who's in a band called Junkie Love and you need to check them out they're fantastic they're doing really well in London at the moment and they're they're doing some very big shows they've been over in Europe I believe as well so they're doing really good things you should check them out Junkie Love. Anyway, this is, uh, this is Axel's, Axel's guitar. Um, it came to us needing a bit of TLC really because we had uh, two uh, volume and tone knob were both uh, lost. They were gone and they needed to be replaced. Um, also, I think the, the, the tone knob on the inside there had kind of, uh, the actual sort of shaft of the pot had been compressed a little bit so we had to sort that out without breaking it, which is really tricky. Um, we sorted out the intonation, which is a real sod on uh, bridges of this type. We sorted the intonation out, so that's all now playing really nicely up and down the neck. Uh, we sorted out that this this pickup is incredible. Uh, it's a, a reissue of a of a, of a, of a 60s one. Um, uh, so so Gibson tell us, but whatever it is, it sounds fantastic. Um, on the on the noodle uh, that you that you hopefully will have heard by now. Um, You'll hear how good it was. Uh, it sounds a great, great uh, pickup. Um, the neck, we've polished all the frets, we've oiled the fingerboard. It was in good, uh, in, in dire need of a bit of a uh, bit of oil on there to to keep it in good shape. So we've done that. Uh, we've put some graphite in the nut to stop uh, any sort of sticking of the um, strings in the nut here. Um, and this was the real bad bit. Actually, we lost a couple of tuners. Uh, in fact, at least the the um, the D and the A strings. Uh, these the the guitar took a fall, and these had uh, these had snapped. So we had to replace these. Uh, so we've got some like for like parts from uh, a good friend of mine in Norwich. I'll put a link in uh, the description uh, and in the in the text below. Um, but now this thing is sounding incredible. Uh, it was a it was a great guitar anyway to start with, but. Um, which always helps. But now we've given it a bit of TLC, it's sounding fab. So if there's anything I can do to help with regards to getting your guitars back on the road, getting them sounding as good as they possibly can, feel free to drop me a message and uh, we'll take it from there. We'll get something sorted for you. Thanks guys. Take care. Have a good one.